this is Alan Fenstermaker here with Pro Wrestling Archives. I'm here with Daredevil Dave. How are you doing, Daredevil? I'm good. I'm having a good time here at Icons of Wrestling. Um, this is fun. This is my first one. Nice, man. Now, what uh, inspired you to become a pro wrestler? Um, I've wrestled since I was eight years old, and I've always watched pro wrestling. So it kind of came full circle when I joined that. I thought it was this. It wasn't. Loved it. Got to a point where I couldn't do that anymore, and then... Uh, decided to start doing this and I've been doing this for about eight years now so nice. now, uh, what promotions have you worked for I've worked for dog in uh, New Jersey WXWC4 um, uh, KCW super crazy okay. just uh, PPW I worked for and I'm still trying to work for him okay. a bunch of different ones I've been going around it's been uh, on fire lately nice. so it's been good what all have you done lately, too? You said you've been on fire. Um, I've gotten myself a sponsorship with uh, My House Sports Gear. And uh, just picking up bookings almost every weekend. Nice. I've taken, like, one weekend off in the last couple of months for my daughter's birthday, and that was it. That's so, cool. now, How do you balance it out, becoming a, being a dad and being a uh, pro wrestler at the same time? Um, I try to spend as much time with my daughter as possible and her brother, my stepson. Um so when I have the free time or if I have a show cancellation, I don't necessarily go and look for another one. Okay. I might just take that weekend to hang out with them because right now it's rare. So, And she just turned one, so it's going about to get to the fun part. Yeah, absolutely, man. Now, uh, what kind of training did you do anyways, and uh, where did you train at? Uh, so I started at NWA Force One, um, or just Force One, whatever you want to call it. Uh, at the time, the trainers were Johnny Calzone, RV1, Joe Gacy, and Sammy Callahan, actually. Okay. So... That was fun. I've been at CCW. I've been at Monster Factory. So I've had a good collection and then a bunch of different seminars with a lot of great people. Now, uh, what's your favorite seminar that you were at? Um, the, my most recent favorite one right now is actually with Simon Gotch, who's over there. Okay. Um, he has a really interesting way of looking at things. Nice. And I've actually taken a lot of what he said to heart and changed how I've put together my matches and how I do certain things in them. So... Um, that was actually a really good one to take. I'm glad yeah, I did. Okay. Now, what's your most memorable match that you've had so far? Uh, I love my match with Mario Gennetti when okay. I teamed with him, and then he did the whole rocker's turn and nice. kicked me in the face. Nice. Um, recently, uh, I had an awesome match with Dave Reed at Super Crazy last month. Okay. So right now, that might be my favorite one. Uh, I mean, I'm just enjoying it. Right now, the stuff I'm doing now is by far my favorite stuff I've been doing. Really? Now, what was that like being a uh, tag partner with Marty, G Marty Gennetti, being a, with a legend like that of his caliber? Uh, well, the Rockers versus uh, the Faces of Fear were one of my favorite matches uh, of all time for WrestleMania 7. So getting the team with you know one half of the Rockers, and they were calling us the new Rockers, and it was, it was cool. It was just surreal, and I, it was a great honor to do it. Okay. Now, do you have anything else you'd like to plug or shoot about right now? Or? Um... I mean, check out, check me out at Dojo Wars for CCW every Wednesday night. Uh, we got super crazy tonight. If you're not at HOH, over on Dittman Street at Holmesburg, uh, Holmesburg Boys Club. This may air after that, so if you missed it, I'm sorry. Uh, I got T-shirts and eight by tens. Go check out My House Sports Gear if you're an amateur wrestler or MMA fighter. And that's about it. Cool, man. And uh, thanks for doing this interview, bro. Thank you. Awesome, Appreciate man. it.